Congratulations, class of 2020. Hello. Hello, class of 2020. Hi, everyone. Congratulations to the class of 2020. You did it. After countless hours of studying, prepping for class, tests, and untold number of homework assignments, you finally did it. Obviously, this isn't the year that any of us would have hoped for, but I'm so amazed at your ability to keep going. You, the graduating class of 2020, are the fiercest group of social justice warriors I've ever encountered. I am honored to witness your growth and your success. I'm so amazed at your ability to keep going and to finish and accomplish this great task. And I am sad to see you go, but so excited to think about the change that you're going to create in this world. Your tenacity, your intelligence, your kindness will help make these hard times much better and the world will improve because of your presence. We're all so very proud of you and uh, we know that you will represent the best of our university, the best of our professions, and the best of humanity going forward. I believe you will make the world a much better place. Today, more than ever, the world needs thoughtfulness. The world needs you. Each one of you will do whatever you set your mind to. Don't be afraid. Have courage. We tip our hat to all of your efforts and wish you the best in all of your endeavors. You've made me a better thinker, a better teacher, a better person. So once again, I say, we all say, thank you. You are all on track to do great things and to help make the world a better place. And now you have a part in this history. I can't wait to read your story. You'll always be a part of the vibrant football community. So onward and upward, congratulations. Thank you for the privilege and the honor of teaching you. From me to you, auguri et félicitations. Go out into the world and do good and ask yourself what must be done. We proudly present DePaul University's 121st Commencement Ceremonies. Members of the faculty, staff, administration, honored guests, and of course our graduates. I'm Salma Ganim, Interim Provost for DePaul University. Welcome to our 121st commencement, DePaul's very first online ceremony. We very much wish we could all be together right now, and we plan to do so to celebrate together as soon as it's safe. Until then, we celebrate today in this online space because the DePaul community would never pass up an opportunity to applaud you, the class of 2020, and your many accomplishments. Commencement is one of the most meaningful ceremonies of a student's academic career, and a DePaul commencement is anything but ordinary. As a Catholic Vincentian University, we share a commitment to uphold the dignity of every single person. And we call that Vincentian personalism. Just like we do every year, each student will be recognized. We want to give every student their moment because that's the DePaul way. It's also why we encourage all the students family members and friends watching to stay until the end, especially because our ceremony will conclude with a special alumni guest, Joe Keery from the hit Netflix series, Stranger Things. Now we know that the class of 2020 faced many challenges this past quarter. In a matter of days, you had to pivot to all remote learning Many of you had to dash back home. Through it all, though, you demonstrated patience and understanding as your faculty transitioned to teach more than 4,000 classes remotely. Your world was turned upside down, but you persevered. But that's not surprising to us, because throughout your time at DePaul, you navigated obstacles 
and rose to the challenge. How? Well, throughout your time at DePaul, your class dedicated at least 300,000 hours to academic internships. 2,559 of you are members of the Honor Society. 200 undergraduate students in the class of 2020 completed double majors. More than a thousand of you, or roughly about 17% of your graduating class, participated in study abroad programs. You danced more than 70 hours for Dimonthon, raising approximately $811,000 for Lurie Children's Hospital of Chicago. The theater school presented more than 300 productions, and the School of Music offered nearly 1,000 performances. Yeah, and yes, you also helped consume two million meals served on our Lincoln Park and Loop campuses, all during your time at DePaul. If you're watching today's ceremony, though, with a loved one, a friend, or a family member, turn to them now and say thank you. And if you're physically apart from many of the ones you love, take a moment and send them a message to express your gratitude. Don't ever forget all the people who helped you get to this moment in your academic career, including, of course, the faculty and staff who shared their talent and wisdom with you. Now, it is your responsibility to carry their teachings forward. On behalf of the entire DePaul community, congratulations. We can't wait to see what you do next. Now it's my privilege to introduce Reverend Guillermo Campuzano, Congregation of the Mission, and Vice President of Mission and Ministry, who will deliver today's invocation, followed by the national anthem sung by John Concepcion. For those who wish to do so, please join me in prayer. Loving God, today is graduation day, a passage, a completion, a new beginning. Today, we pray in thanksgiving for the Paul University's class of 2020. Our students, with the help of faculty, staff, family, and friends, have met the challenges and kept the faith to the commitments of their studies. And they're becoming the kind of people they want to and can be in our society. God, the graduation of this year happens in the context of the most challenging events of our generation. It is in the challenging moments that you refine us. The joy that our students are experiencing today cannot be stolen. We will do well to remember that nothing can steal our joy and our peace when they are a gift that comes from our inner self. Please, do not allow our many trials of today, as difficult as they may seem, to distract us from rejoicing and celebrating this meaningful moment in the lives of so many in our DePaul family. In this context, it can be tempting for us to forget to be joyful. Yet, it is in the challenging moments of life that you prove yourself close friendly, faithful, you are always with us. Our joy today is not derived from our comfort, but it is a joy that is happening despite our uncomfortableness, our distance, our inability to gather, to hug, and to say goodbye. Our joy comes from our belief that no matter what is happening, none of us is alone. We will continue to reach out and to support each other. Please, dear God, continue to educate us all, especially our graduating students, and shape us more completely into the human beings we need to be to go through the fire together 
and to prevail as one human family. Good and loving God, please bless and guide our graduates as they reach this end and as they chart new beginnings. May what they have learned by being here with us in our Vincentian classrooms allow them to truly be women and men for others. May what we have learned from them enable us to be the same. Please help our graduates use all that they have learned to serve others in true solidarity and kindness, to seek ways to help the poor, the marginalized, and those who are suffering, and to always seek the greater good and make our world a better place. Finally, God, we thank you for giving us the opportunity to build our Dipola community with these, our students, while they were here. Though they are living now, our campuses, we know that they will always be with us as part of the Dipol family. And we ask that the bonds that have been created here remain strong despite any distance. Bless and protect them and all those they love. Amen. Oh, say, can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleaming, whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight or the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming and the rocket's red glare the bombs bursting in air gave proof through the night that our flag was still there. Oh, say, does that star-spangled banner yet wave o'er the land of the free and the home of the brave? Dear graduates, it is my pleasure to join you today in this happy occasion. I hope you will remember it forever, not because of the unusual circumstances we are going through, but because of the wonderful memories and achievements of your tenure as a student here at DePaul. As some of you uh, may know, I came to DePaul in 2000. Uh, 16, like many of you, uh, almost four years ago. And uh, I came to DePaul to learn, because as uh, also some of you may know, I was not originally trained in the liberal arts. I was trained as an architect. And it was later in life that I discovered the richness and the power of the liberal arts and the social sciences. Like you all, I was educated by our extraordinary faculty in the uh, amazing disciplines of the liberal arts and social sciences. During your tenure here at DePaul, I hope that you have become uh, perpetual learners. I'm sure that now you understand a lot better the world around us. And beyond that, I think that you can influence, you can engage that world because you know how to do good and how to do it well. Now, of course, we've all heard the say that with uh, great power comes great responsibility. And yes, I have to admit, I'm a big fan of Spider-Man, but I think it's true. 
And uh, I think that uh, by working together, you can all deliver us to a better tomorrow. So as you move into this next project in life, as an architect may tell you, I hope that you will always remember that uh, the Paul and the LAS faculty will always be here for you. We hope that you remain in touch and that the liberal arts will be always with you. And now it is my pleasure and an honor to introduce your fellow classmate and student speaker, Jinan Shehadan. Jinan is graduating today with a bachelor in public policy and a minor both in Islamic world studies and Arabic. She's planning to start a Georgetown law this fall. Jinan is a DePaul leadership scholar who has served as Senator of Liberal Arts and Social Sciences in student government. Jinan, as our tagline reads, is intellectually curious and actively engaged. Please help me welcome Jinan. Esteemed faculty, friends, family, and class of 2020, most of you may know me as the girl that's always in sack or outside the patio of arts and letters protesting about some political issue, that or walking into class 20 minutes late. Honestly, when I originally wrote this address, I never imagined that I'd be giving it in this way. And I know this may not be the graduation we all hoped for, some of us may be tuning in from our PJs, but here we all are, after countless obstacles celebrating each other in the past four years of our lives. Now, before I begin, I want you all to take a moment and think about how you personally define change or impact. This question is especially important to ask ourselves now amidst all these large scale, systematic, bigger than us problems, to ask ourselves, what does change look like for us? As LES majors, we are all here today because we have some vision of change or impact in our society. For me, I always imagined that change had to be some grand gesture that impacted a large number of people. However, coming to Nepal changed my perspective on change. As I formed relationships with various communities, whether it be UMMA, SJP, DCSA, SGA, I learned that change is not numerical or bold or groundbreaking. Change is informing relationships with others. That when like-minded, passionate people come together, that is when the real work begins. Lila Watson once said, if you have come to help me, then you are wasting your time. But if you have come because your liberation is bound with mine, then let us work together. And I've seen it here at DePaul with all of you. I've seen us stand up with one another and protect our, each other amidst the Muslim ban, to host teachings about police brutality and organize national campaigns. I've seen us cry with one another after the New Zealand attacks. But most of all, in all these examples and more, I've seen us simply come together. Change isn't some big superhero movie-worthy action that's going to save the world overnight. Change takes time and commitment. See, you probably won't be able to change the world on your own, but you can change the world as part of a larger movement. And by using your personal purpose, you can change that small world around you first. You see, all of us were placed on this earth for a general purpose, but your individual task is to find your personal purpose. That is, to understand how you can create change in the circles and spaces around you with the skills and strengths that the classroom of life has equipped you with. Perhaps changing the world for you is going to another community and educating yourself. Perhaps it's not walking by that homeless man you see on your daily commute, but stopping and asking how he is. Perhaps it's shouting Free Palestine and Black Lives Matter in the streets of Chicago. Or maybe, just maybe, in our fast-producing, production-obsessed world, it's simply being. We are living in a time where we cannot afford to remain passive about our condition. And we in the College of LES especially understand this. We can no longer expect change or simply ask for it. We must demand it. So today, I invite you all again to think about how you personally define change or impact and how you can use what you've learned at DePaul to create that change. Now, as we leave our chosen home and family, 
Many of us may not know our next steps or where we will be five years from now. If this year has taught us anything, it's taught us that life is full of uncertainties. But it has also taught us more than anything to treasure every moment and to treasure every experience and relationship that we have. And while there are not many guarantees in this world, there is one thing I can promise you. You have the freedom to choose what to do with your time. You have the freedom to choose your impact and legacy. Because of what I've learned from all of you, I am no longer frustrated at the state of our world because I know that we can make a difference, that we will make a difference. Today, I dare you to be brave. I dare you to break your heart and care about the world. I dare you to take the extra step outside of your comfort zone. But most importantly, I dare you to create change together. I would like to close by a quote by Malcolm X. I am not educated, nor am I an expert in any particular field, but I am sincere, and my sincerity is my credentials. As we leave here with our hard-earned degrees, we must remember that the world does not need more politicians, doctors, or artists. We need more politicians, doctors, and artists who care. We are the heroes we have been waiting for. We are the generation we have been waiting for. Class of 2020, for the past four years, I have been inspired by your resilience, your kindness, your ability to come together in good times and in bad. And I know I cannot physically be there to congratulate all of you on this outstanding achievement. I will always take pride in knowing that I am part of the class of 2020. Thank you. The Dean will now present the candidates for the conferral of degrees. President Esteban, on behalf of the faculty and staff of the College of Liberal Arts and Social Sciences, I respectfully present the candidates and recommend that the announced degrees be conferred upon them. By the authority vested in me, by the Board of Trustees and the State of Illinois, I confer upon you the degree for which you have been recommended with all the rights, privileges, and responsibilities appertaining thereunto. The following candidates have successfully completed the requirements and have been awarded their respective degrees. Violet Z. Abawi. Hind Ahmad Abdelaziz. Jennifer Abelmona. Randy W. Abelmona. Kyle Matthew Acevedo. Catherine Ann Adam. Melissa S. Adams. Chiche Zoom Andrea Adibe. Hadaya W. Afzal. Caitlin Marie Aiken. Stephen T. Akers. Fatma Lala Aksu. Fatima Jasim A. H. Al Ansari. Maryam Ali A. B. Al Surar. Ahmed Sakir Salem Bin Ham Al Amari. Brianna Page Abimbala Aleg Balaye. Imran Ali. Hassan Aliani. Abdullah Rashid Al Kubaisi. Salah A. Al Shamari. Connor J. Altier. Hussam A. Alzubi. Sweta Amatya. Theodore O. Anderson. Jennifer Guadalupe Andrade. Sylvia Antonucci. Alec George Apellian. Renee Nadine Appelt. Zoe Apaya. Alexander Archer. Grace Weaver Archibald. Kayla N. Arnett. 
Melissa K. Arietta, Margot Aruda, Jason Ash, Alex Richard Asta, Angelica Alejandra Avila, Cynthia Avila, Carla J. Avila Polanco, Abdallah Awad, Alina Bacos, Grace M. Buffo, Jackson David Barr, Timotope Z. Bacare, Chad M. Baker, Seth Baker, Nicarina Marie Balaz, Maya Banks, Emmanuel Barra Hart, Landon Christopher Barber, Jessica M. Barnesel, Christopher Barr, Ellen Marie Barrett, Victoria J. Barron, Elizabeth Bauman, Ixchel Batista, Alexis Bazemore, Alec L. Bier, Alexis Cheyenne Beeman, Catherine Peggy Bean, Shelby T. Beasley, Michael J. Bochamp, Mary Margaret Bowden, Adam C. Beaver, Rachel C. Becker, Sophia Grayson Bell, Krista A. Beltrain, Tina Natasha Berto, Caitlin S. Butelsbacher, Lou Bissio, Tracy LaTanya Blackburn, Jediah R. Blakeney, Tyler Xavier Blanchett, Elizabeth L. Bland, Alana Mae Blattner, Mary Elise Unger Bluestone, John Liu Boise, Margaret A. Benucci, Megan E. Boone, Sydney Borden, Christian Borky, Tristan Bovey, Jennifer Lachey Boyd, Emma R. Breen, Meredith Joyce Brewer, Michael E. Brewer, Coco Lori Brown, Dwight Franklin Brew, Crystal Bryson, Canessa Bueno, Lowry Buffum, Andrew Banakis, Zarin Balut, Maya Elizabeth Burris, Haley Burton, Eden Elizabeth Butler, Oslin Bynum, Summer C. Caliendo, Diego Alexander Camacho, Dalton G. Campbell, Eric T. Kanan, Susanna C. Cardenas Soto, Madison R. Carey, Paul Ismael Carisma, Jasmine Leonilla Carrasco, Gabriela D. Carrillo, Audrey J. Carroll, 
Margaret Carson, Christopher Blake Carter, Julia Claire Carey, Ryan Cashin, Ryan Alexander Caspery, Elizabeth Ann Cassidy, Christina Cazares, Justin M. Selmick, Nicolette A. Chambers, Isabella Chapman, Matthew P. Chappell, Stacy Charney, Jenna Charniak, Mercedes M. Chavez, Janan Mohammed Shahedi, Nina Shahedi, Samantha Chalemsky, Dominique L. Chu, Liana Zaya Cherkina, Michael Ryan Cipriano, Rodin J. Clegg, Olivia Clancy, Alexa K. Clark, Crystal Clark, Joshua Andreas Clayton, Samuel T. Clemens, Candace Aaron Cobb, Paul F. Colucci, Mary Ellen Combs, Catherine Anna Conley, Lourdes G. Contreras, Alexandra C. Corley, Aylin Corona, Miriam Cortinoves, Brandon L. Coat, Chanel Maisha Cox, Cole Cragen, Caitlin Ashley Crawford, Julia Cristales, James H. Crockett, Madeline Jean Crozier, Isaiah Crudup, Anna Renee Custis, Anna Carolina De Silva Moriera Jorge, Jessamine Grace Adams Daniels, Daniel Darbondi, Alan Davis, Amber Giselle Davis, Emma Claire Davis, Jakara Grace Davis, Audrey Elizabeth DeBauver, Kenneth E. Decker, Madera De Freitas, Sofia Del Palacio Ugarte, Isela Guadalupe Delgado, Nathan Denson, Jacqueline Grace Duber, Mairead A. DeWitt, Ashnar Delacchio, John Michael D. Mercurio, Ann Inez De Paula, Amelia C. Diamond, Franco Aureli Diaz, Aaron Dillon, Jennifer L. Dixon, Jeremy Dixon, Lunesia K. Dixon, Claire N. Donahue, Aeneas Arson O'Donnell, Megan Donnelly, Ian Donovan, Muriel Lakitra Dorsey Johnson, Mariko M. Dowling, Isabella Constantine Downs, Margot S. Downey, 
Lauren E. Drafts, Anthony S. Drainer, Allison Dressman, Nora Agnes Drew, Amanda M. Drexler, Perry Ellen Drury, Caitlin Dubose, Taylor Juliana Dewerson, Eleanor Jane Duran, Dana Dutcher, Jory A. Dvorak, Sarah R. Dim, Danielle Eccleston, Chelsea Marie Echevarria, Samuel James Eckert, Nilu Turek L. Macy, Maria Dora Eliza Raraz, Abigail Shireen Ellis, Lerone Ellison, Jonathan P. Engelman, Adam D. Enright, Ryan Eschel, Katie Jan Esslinger, Amy Bailey Estrana, Graham Evanson, Selena Andrea Evora, Katie Marie Fabsik, Rick Fafalena, Emma Nicole Fantacune, Riley Carico Farkas, Avery E. Farron, Delilah Del Carmen Finneran, Michael Patrick Flaherty, Kelly Rachel Flanagan, Jose L. Flores, Joseph Folsom, Lisa Foster, Jordan Fromm, Ginevra Francesconi, Cassandra Sophia Frank, Molly A. Franklin, Paulina Friedman, Alora Christina French, Samuel Kent Freund, Mary C. Friend, Molly Marie Fuge, Michelle Marie Fugel, Madeline J. Funk, Madonna Furcon, Brianna Gaines, Gabriella Margaret Galvin, Annette Galvez, Esperanza Garcia, Mario A. Garcia, Griselda Garibay, Michael J. Garza, Layla Yakara Gay, Georgia G. Gerber, Ileana Jahari, Justin T. Gibrick, Lorraine T. Gibson, Emma E. Gear, Megan M. Geese, Paige Michelle Gilberg, Alyssa Gill, Angeline Gilmore, Sierra Giassi, Bertha Angela Godoy, Emma Saylor Goldberg, Rachel Jean Goldberg, Karina J. Gomez, Nico Gomez, Sophia Vivian Gomez, Jenna Lynn Gonzalez, Ariel Christina Gonzalez, 
Desiree Gonzalez. Jaime Gonzalez. Irene Gonzalez Hernandez. Jermaine Alberto Gooding. Sarah Gooding. Paul Robert Gordon. Emily C. Gorski. Claudia Goycochea. Colin Benjamin Graham. Lucy Ann Grundhauser. Randeep Reddy Gouda. McKenna Marie Gwerton. Jamie Gutschall. Zaina Habibi. Dylan Matthew Hahn. Johanna S. Hale. Sydney Nicole Halliburton. Erica Ann Hall. Paige Elizabeth Hall Petrie. Kylie Faye Hamakawa. Jonathan G. Handrup. Madeline Marie Hamp. Madeline Hapold. Michael Jose Hargrove. Megan Marie Harris. Pamela Barbara Harris. Rebecca L. Harrison. Nadine M. Hartnett. Vanessa M. Hasman. Martin C. Hasler. Julian V. Hayda. Jing Yua He. Ethan E. Hike. Emily M. Henderson. Allison M. Hennessy. Brittany C. H. Henry. Kylie M. Heron. Zia M. Hirsch. Shannon Elizabeth Hitzman. Sarah Hanidi. Idina Hojic. Julia C. Hagakayan. Whitney Nicole Houston. Flanya Hoxha. Amelia J. Harubi. Chelsea Tyler Hudson. Nicole A. Huff. Suhoon Her. Danielle Ann Hurley. Michelle Hurtado. Bridget Ann Hudson. Stuart Clayton Hudson. Ishma Farooz Iqbal. Zachary Isoda. Ulisa Ana E. Izagiri. Monifa K. Jaber. Isabella A. Jablonska. Alexander W. Jackson. Matthew Jacques. Azora Jalili. George W. Javaris. Brooke Jenkins. Amy L. Jesenowski. Elizabeth Johnson. Jillian Sandra Johnson. Kayla D. Johnson. Olivia H. Johnson. Ashanti Jones. Caroline Elizabeth Jones. Christiana M. Jones. Amber Rose Julius. Morgan Aaron Kale Ackerman. Madison H. Calvota. Elliot Kang. Pia Kanoi. 
Loyla Kowal, Christina Kasabi, Emily A. Katzman, Joshua S. Kaufman, Jillian Marie Keller, David Kelly, Patricia Louise Kelsey, Liam G. Kemi, Dalen Kenny, Huma Khan, Muhammad Ramiz Khan, Imama Kawaja, Nicole Kim, Jessica Lynn King, Cora J. Kinney, William Lucas Kirkpatrick, Nora Emily Klein, Anne Marie Klindehagen, Jonathan Klinger, Delaney M. Clunt, Zoe C. Knight, Zachary M. Nomeyer, Magda M. Colossa, Dimitri A. Kolokotronis, Robert Kostadinov, Catherine P. Koslick, Jessica Nicole Cupitz, Caroline Francis Cusel, Bradley Scott Laws, Emily Susan Lane, Maritza Lara, Zachary L. Luria, Rachel A. LaRoe, Kristen Michelle Larson, Jennifer Lascone, Lamicus Lavender, Abigail L. Lee, Brandon Lee, Roxana Lewicki, Jaylene C. Leva, Hannah Marie Lindenberg, Emma K. Littell Jensen, Maggie Lucille Little, Eric T. Litz, Keelion Liu, Hannah Michelle Lloyd, Megan Rose Lloyd, Amanda Lofelholz, Eloisa Lopez, Evan J. Lowry, Margaret Luxem, Caitlin M. Lynch, Joy C. Lyons, Brian Mata, Miriam Maria Madrid Forgas, Patrick Dominic Meyer, Kayla Hunt Malinowski, Miranda J. Malinowski, Anne Ryle Mallet, Andrew Giles Maloney, Zan S. Mandel, Olivia M. Marr, Jeriana J. Marshall, Napasha D. Martin, Jesus E. Martinez, Susanna Martinez, Sophia Masenga, Allison Mateoisian, Hannah Grace Mathis, Nicole L. Matei, Brittany A. Maxwell, Rachel E. McCann, Cora L. McCarran, Ryan E. McCarthy, 
Colin John McCormick, Kaswana McCoy, Jaru McCulley, Caitlin McDonough, Anna Rose McGoldrick, Grace Ann McKay, Crawford Ian McKenzie, Claire E. McKittrick, Brenda J. Medina, Cordell Rowe Medley, Marissa M. Merlino, Kate Riley Malamans, Hannah L. Michael Schwartz, Matthew C. Mitchell, Connor Miller, Lucy Elaine Miller, Michaela Jane Milligan, Chance M. Mitchell, Aaron Mitchell, Tiffany Jean Mitchell, Angelica Molina, Kirill Monev, Ariana Brene Moore, Victoria Mora, Carlos Morales, Emily Christina Moreno, Allison M. Moser, Kimberly K. Mua, Andreas Paul Muller, John Mulhern, Edwin Munoz, Jonathan Patrick Monroe, Jessica Muscat, Afra Cameron Nerryman, Philip J. Nassos, Mary Catherine Nedbalski, Jamie Neely, Alexandria Neal, Erica A. Nelson, James A. Nelson, Margaret M. Nelson, Genevieve Nemeth, Annika L. Ness, Jonathan Andres Navarez, Tom Nguyen, Emma Nippa, Natalie Nifasnanda, Destiny Gabrielle Nobles, Jade Nolan, Marwa Mustafa Naur, Miranda K. Novell, Astrid Marisol Nunez, Dominique Daphne Wampa, Margaret O'Brien, Kate Christine O'Connor, William D. O'Connor, Claire Sinead O'Mahony, Paul Kinsman O'Neill, Catherine Anna O'Reilly, Abigail Sarah Oberdeck, Patrick Oberly, Alicia A. Oser, Elijah Olamide Ogunkoya, Caitlin S. Oliver, Tyler Anna Renee Olmstead, Patricia Oriana, Robert O. Ostermuller, Ikram Othman, Holly Renee Olette, Liam T. Owen, Yovana Peitch, Megan Elizabeth Palmer, Talbot Palmer, Victoria B. Pansowitz, Antonio K. Pampas, 
Bara Parashak, Bumi Parikh, Darius Rashad Parker, Timothy F. Parzik, Demetria G. Pates, John Bays Patlovich, Jared Parker Patron, Daniel P. Pepe, Marco Antonio Peral Ortiz, Anna L. Peterson, Megan Elizabeth Fursdorf, Katrina N. Fid, Keaton Phillips, Megan L. Phillips, Ethan Russell Phipps, Zachary A. Picozzi, Caitlin Aletha Pearson, Tice Curly Pinheiro Burial, Jesse Benjamin Pink, Megan K. Pitrick, Jonathan W. Planman, Miguel Angel Posada, Ashley Posey, Daniel H. Posley, Raymond T. Preston, Aaliyah Morgan Price, Olivia Madison Pritchard, Jeremy Ryan Prince, Grace Ann Pyatt, Rowan M. Quinane, Sophie Emma Ramey, Amy Teresa Ramirez, Elena Saren Rangai, Michael Vincent Rangel, Caroline G. Rowe, Alexis D. Regan, Rachel A. Reed, Dulana D. Reese, Megan Elizabeth Renner, Connor Scott Reddick, Nicholas P. Ryback, Leslie S. Rice, Jason Rico, Brendan Michael Rigney, Amelia Kathleen Rivas, Janessa Rivera, Imana Kayinde Rivers, Ina Rizvich, Mitchell Edwin Roach, Natalie Robbins, Emma A. Robertson, Stephen John Rodney, Jacqueline A. Rodriguez, Nicholas Rojas Elcati, Rebecca Romero, Rachel M. Ropsky, Robert Aaron Rosenbaugh, Julia Ann Rosenwinkel, Daniel H. Rosiak, Michael Trey Ross, Jennifer Roth, Aaron E. Rowe, Maxwell I. Rose Sutton, Ashley Rose Rubino, Matthew Alexander Ruby, Lane J. Ruda, Annalise M. Ruhi, Jessica A. Ruiz, Olivia Ruiz, Rima Rustam, Layla Sadat, James W. Sadler, Leslie Segastume, Angeline B. Salazar Schulist, 
Cindy Salcedo, Gonzalo Enrique Sanchez, Caleb Sanchez, Yolabeth Sandoval, Ashley M. Santelli, Parker K. Serra, Emily Lourdes Saucedo, Mackenzie C. Savage, Chris Shafley, Joseph Schaefer, Holden Patrick Scheidel, William F. Schur, Mary Kathleen Schneider, Kira Rachel Shore, John Schuler, Dana Christine Scully, Michael Jeremy Seidenfeld, Cassandra Lynn Seltzer, Anna Carol Shapiro, Adrian R. Shea, McKenna K. Sheehan, Jacob Shelley, Zubin M. Shering, Isabel May Shively, Laura A. Shopless, Bivik Prakas Shrestha, Susanna Shrestha, Christopher Herbert Silber, Jonathan D. Singer, Alyssa M. Scalar, Alexis Maria Scordillas, Brittany Philomena Smart, Grant Nathaniel Smith, Madeline H. Smith, Devante LaShawn Smith Lee, Kevin Snyder, Rosie Solano, Sophia R. Saluri, Dennis Sopic, Christian D. Sorensen, Margaret J. Sorensen, Marvin Soto Perez, Zayeta Z. Sugat, Rose Spence, Caroline A. Stasica, Riley Joseph Stetler, John P. Stevens, Clarissa Stewart, Milo Birch Stewart, Maya Stidham, Amanda Nicole Stachetti, Allison Stogsdale, Mark Stahl, Jacob Samuel Stone, Samuel L. Stone, Amanda Lauren Storyward, Caitlin Marie Stout, Bridget Strathman, Zohair H. Sultan, Sarah Elizabeth Svensson, Muthana Swice, Julia Mae Swarty, Sabrina Zoss, Channing Nicole Tan, Alina Tabor, Eliza J. Talaga, Zi Yang Tan, Miranda Lee Tate, Tyree Taylor, Lauren Ashley Terranova, Ariel Ashley Thompson, Ethan B. Thompson, Hannah Sophia Thompson, Mary Hannah Thornby, Samuel Carlin Tymeyer, 
Josh Z. Ticka, Jasmine N. Tiller, Aaron K. Tinnen, Fook Lee Hong To, Myra Toledo, Santa C. Torijo, Marcus Jared Towns, Angela G. Tucker, Priya R. Upaluri, Lucas Michael Urbane, Berker Estura, Reed Anthony Vaughn, Maria Paula Vega Carrillo, Diamari Noemi Velez, Sonia Abby Ventura, Estefany Vera, Alexander Benjamin Verde, Rebecca Vici, Jared J. Vick, Selena Villegas, Francesca Vitali, Stephanie Vu, Andrea Walker, Isaac Chaska Nakai Walker, Chatobanaya Chavon Walters, Jada Ward, Callie V. Ward, Paula M. Warda, Brittany N. Ware, Amy Marissa Wasowitz, Stephen M. Watka, Caitlin Watkins, Chris W. Watkins, Annabelle Watson, Jessica Day Watson, Jessica Waugh, Naya Karen Weathers, Fern Athena Weber, Lisa Frederick C. Weber, Kelly Catherine Wedlake, Edward Quinn Waney, Andrea Marie Weiss Tracy, Keely S. White, Mikey Whitehead, Matthew K. Wilkins, Haley Christine Williams, Katrina Michael Williams, Madeline M. Williamson, Madison E. Willis, David L. Wilson, Maya Mercedes Wilson, Nina Rose Wilson, Emily R. Winkler, Allison Nicole Wadka, Darnell D. Wright, Megan Georgina Wright, Rebecca Therese Wright, Kathleen Marie Ruck, Olivia Wadajewski, Riley Yaxley, Adriana J. Yochelson, Margaret H. Young, Ruth P. Young, Megan G. Youngerman, Jenning Yu, Rita J. Zaidi, Nicole Zavlinski, Carlo J. Zenner, Umberto Zermeno, Victoria I. Zicina, Ryan Thomas Zincina, Catherine Marie Zeitlow, Maria Catherine Zoll, Rebecca Marie Zolton, Alana Francis Zucca, 
Kate E. Zucker. Members of the Vincentian community and the clergy, trustees, life trustees, faculty, administration, staff, and honored guests. I'm Gabriel Esteban, president of DePaul University. Thank you for joining us today to celebrate the DePaul University class of 2020. Your presence, even in this online space, means everything to us. This was not the year or the commencement ceremony anyone expected, and I am inspired by the tenacity and drive the class of 2020 has demonstrated throughout this time. I am also extremely grateful to all the faculty and staff who made the swift transition to remote learning, as well as the many people who made today's com online commencement ceremony possible. I especially would like to recognize the members of the DePaul community who continued to report to campus throughout the spring quarter. DePaul University, class of 2020. The world is a scary place right now. Graduating from college always comes with a degree of uncertainty. Is this the right job for me? Am I choosing the right path? Will I achieve my dreams? I know all your questions are magnified right now, and it's okay to feel scared. Now, more than ever, the world needs DePaul graduates. There are more than 6,000 students in the class of 2020, and the world needs every single one of you. We need entrepreneurs, economists, and hospitality leaders, journalists, filmmakers, computer scientists and game designers, teachers, counselors, writers, artists, diplomats, and historians, nurses, psychologists, scientists and mathematicians, musicians, and actors. The world needs DePaul graduates because you know what it takes to succeed. You know how to roll up your sleeves and do whatever it takes to get the job done. You understand the importance of giving back. And you have the courage to ask, what must be done? At DePaul, our Catholic Vincentian mission to serve the public good is at the heart of everything we do. We have taught you to fight for social justice, help those most in need, listen, and be kind. Please keep our Vincentian values close to your heart. Be mindful of the responsibility that comes with a DePaul diploma. The diploma that bears the name of St. Vincent de Paul. DePaul University, class of 2020, you are ready to serve a changing world. Transformed by your DePaul education, grounded in mission, make us proud. The last step in your journey at DePaul is to be inducted into the alumni community. It is my distinct honor to introduce our special alumni guest, Joe Keery, who graduated from the theater school in 2014 and now plays Steve Harrington on the hit Netflix series, Stranger Things. DePaul has always been proud to call Joe one of our own. And my wife and I are big fans of his work.
We're very grateful he could join us today to celebrate the class of 2020. Please welcome Joe Keery. Hi, everybody. My name is Joe Keery. I'm an alumni of DePaul University, class of 2014 uh, from the theater school, and I'm honored to be this year's alumni inductor uh, and to welcome the class of 2020 into the Alumni Association. So congratulations, class of 2020. Um, when I think about my time at DePaul, I think about uh, all the hard work. Uh, I mean, DePaul really conditions their students to work. If you ask any of the students at the theater school, they, they're definitely working very hard. Um, it really conditioned me to fill my days doing the thing that I love to do and, and, then, and then work towards goals that I really set for myself. So now, uh, more than ever as graduates and kind of given the current state of the world, I think it's, I think it's really important to keep your foot on the gas and to, and to really go after every single opportunity to, to make your own opportunities to, uh, you know, if you work hard, at something that you love to do and you can make a living doing it, then you won't have to work a day in your life. That's always been my mentality and I feel so lucky to be able to do the work that I'm able to do. Um, and it wouldn't have been possible truly without DePaul. I look back on my time there so fondly, all the friends that I've made, all, all the experiences that I had, um, but truly now the real fun begins because you get to take everything that you've learned and everything that you've worked towards at DePaul and, and put it to use. And uh, now you can start this new chapter in your life and uh, always look back fondly at your time at DePaul. So congratulations again. And uh, now to induct the class of 2020. Inscribed upon this scroll are the names of the members of DePaul University's 121st graduating class, the class of 2020. We accept these graduates into the DePaul University Alumni Association. Members of the 121st graduating class, we welcome you to the next step in your lifelong connection with DePaul as students of yesterday, graduates today, and alumni forever. You are now part of an even larger DePaul community of over 190,000 alumni living around the world. The continued vitality of DePaul University depends upon each of us as alumni and our pledge of commitment and service to the university. We invite you to accept membership by moving your tassel from the right to the left as a symbolic gesture of your transformation from a student of DePaul University to a lifelong learner and citizen of the world. Graduates, please move your tassels. You should really do it and congratulations to the class of 2020.